What's good, y'all boys and girls? It's your one and only Sauce Money B. Brian and B. Bryce Gaming. And today's video is about the dunk it's contest. You feel me? How to win the dunk contest and how to how to how to do dunks. You feel me in the dunk contest? Cause every time when I go to the dunk contest, I always like I be losing cause I don't know how to dunk. Like there's no like tutorial on how to like you feel me? Uh do the dunk contest like how to do the dunks and all of that stuff so i remember previous two k's was kind of hard i think you had to tap buttons or whatever and i don't know it's kind of weird but today i kind of figured it figured how to do it you feel me i was in the all-star i'm at the all-star point now in uh in my nba 2k season you feel me i'm in the all-star team and then i did get elected to the three-point contest but i was lucky enough to be in the dunk contest and I kept trying this thing over and over and over. So that's one tip on how to win the dunk contest. If you losing, yo, know, just before the thing is over, just close the application and then reload NBA 2K20 and try again. So that's how I, I, I learned how to, you know, do the dunks. I tried different things. And then, yeah, when you about to do your dunks, it shows like square. And I kept thinking, do I hold it or something? But actually, you... you all right, so for the dunk select, this is what it shows. It shows three different colors, which is easy, average, and hard. What I do is go with the hard because I'm facing amazing dunkers. So they're going to have high scores. So what I did, the style I went with was with the reverse, and the dunk I went with was the touch behind the back, which is hard. And the reason why you go with hard is you got to pull it off. You're going to get a 50. Check this out. Right here with the squares, I thought I had to hold them, but really you just have to tap them. You feel me? You have to tap it at a specific moment of time. Uh, sometimes the bar be going fast, sometimes it goes slow, so you gotta you gotta time it perfectly. But if you miss time it, you can always dashboard and close the application and retry again. That's what I was doing. So that dunk right there was nice. You feel me? It was a nice dunk, and it gave me a perfect 50 for that because I timed it perfectly by tapping square and it just worked for me so that's why i go with the the hard dunks that's what you gotta do you gotta go with the hard dunk and if you pull them off bro, right, you're gonna get crazy scores look i'm facing dennis smith jr zion williamson and and donovan mitchell like these guys are amazing dunkers you feel me they're great so they're gonna have high scores so the only way to really beat them is like to just do hard dunks like you seen, Dennis Smith Jr. had a score of a 47. Like me having a score of a 37 or a 40 was not really gonna do much at all. So you feel me? You got you guys gotta do the hard dunks. But you know you could always have fun and do the easy and the and the average if you're not really trying to win. But um, if you're trying to win, bro, you gotta go for the hard dunks, bro. Cause look, look what they doing, man. Look, he just did a uh, a. Uh, he did he just did a through the leg bro in mid air look look at this through the leg and then he slammed it reverse he got a 43 now let's see if dennis Smith jr can top the 47 if he can top the 47 this is proof to what i'm trying to tell you guys look he had a 47 and this i don't think he's gonna get a high score for that but still when you add them up bro from the 47 the first 47 it's gonna be crazy look he got 37 so now it's my turn again this time i'm gonna go with a min a windmill and i'm gonna do a double nope i'm not gonna do a double spin because zion already did it i'm gonna do uh the wrong way 360 through the legs so what you guys do when the thing pop up look at the speed you gotta make sure you time this correctly look a tap tap that's all you gotta do all you gotta do i didn't get a 50 on this one but still like like i said like getting a 50 in the highest score you can it adds up bro so if you mess up and you get like a, a 37 or a 40 and you still got that 50 that still give you that little boost that advantage over the other dunkers so um i got a 40 so 40 plus 50 i got a 90 i'm still on top of everybody and i think uh Dennis Smith Jr. or was it Donovan Mitchell? He had the highest one out of all of us. I think he had a 43. He had a 43, and um, still I'm still on top because I had the 50. 50 is good. So Zion Williamson, let's see what he could do. If he get a 50, and I I strike out and get a 37, then I'm out of luck. That right there was a nice dunk, but I don't think that's gonna get a perfect 50. 
Yeah, I don't think that one's gonna get a perfect 50. So this is like my first year, like, uh, actually getting the dunk contest, like, correct. Like, I didn't know how to do it. I'm not gonna lie to you guys. Now I finally figured out how to do dunk contest. I wish there was a game mode where you could just custom, like, oh, he got a 47. You see, that was nearly a 50. So that mean I need to get like a 45. A 45 or at least, uh, I think like a 40 or higher. And then I'll be safe. And this is Donovan Mitchell. Ooh. That was a nice dunk right there. But like I was saying, like, yeah, we need a game mode like where we can actually control who is going to be in a dunk contest and who is going to be in a three-point contest. Not through simulation and, and my league and my career to be, you know, only being able to access that it's nba 2k20 i don't know why they didn't add that into the game yet probably i don't know i don't know why it doesn't make sense i don't know the old 2k's you could and look he got a 47 bro everyone is getting a 47 let's see what dennis smith jr is about to do he needs to top his 37 oh that was a sick dunk so i'm guessing everybody's pulling out their best dunks so i'm gonna have to go crazy look at this Look at this, one hand. He didn't even switch hands. And they gave him a 43 for that one. So I think Zion is in the lead. I mean, in the lead. So let's see what I'm gonna do. Am I gonna use props? Uh. Oh no. I'm trying to find something really good. Teammate, teammate help. Need something really cool. Two hand throws. Honey double dip. Kind of sound interesting. One hand throws the hot potato. Oh, that sounds interesting. All right, I got to pull this off if I want to win. All right, so you see how small that thing is? Like, you got to do a position. Look. Oh, oh, nice. Nice. Precision, guys. You guys got to be, you know, quick with it because it's you can mess up could mess up because i was messing up a lot look at this this is the hot potato dunk oh <laughs> look at this that's dope so i i gotta get a 50 for that one bro i never even seen that before i gotta get a 50 for that one i got a 44 which is still good that was enough for, to put me over the top over zion williamson and that's how i won the dunk contest guys so um, thank you guys for watching please like comment subscribe in this video you guys learned how to you know dunk in the dunk contest how to win the dunk contest and um groovy club signing out join the gang you feel me subscribe hit that subscribe button more videos coming soon we are close to 100,000 subscribers really close just letting you guys know groovy club signing out groovy gang